Yo, what's up, dudes? It's your brother, Eagle Brevin. We're back with episode two of our Borderlands 3 Krieg DLC playthrough, man. And if you guys haven't checked out the first episode, go check it out. We started, of course, the Krieg DLC in lieu of our Krieg Let's Play coming up with Borderlands 2. Plus, we do have the Borderlands movie trailer. And to me, Krieg looks like the most interesting character in the movie so far. So, I uh, like, why not? Let's learn a little bit more about Krieg, man. So, of course, we're going to jump right into it. Again, if you guys want to go check that out, go check out the first episode. Uh, but I did realize... <laughs> That, uh, I was just joking about the mayonnaise jar. That the audio was a little bit low in the first episode, so I cranked it up just a little bit in game. If the audio is off, let me know, man. And I, I know, like, th this is the first time I'm doing kind of a playthrough with this setup, so if it's too loud, I apologize. If it's not loud enough, let me know. I'll crank it up for the next episode. So now we've completed the Krieg statue with the old buzz axe, man. What's next? The gauntlet? And what fresh madness are we gonna have to survive to find it? More! More soul gut! Alright, so we gotta get his gauntlet now. We got his- so I think we're basically completing the statue to get to the loot, to get to like the- whatever they called it. Not the vault, but they called it something, bro. So we gotta complete this statue and uh, pretty much just go on a bunch of fest, fetch quests for Krieg. Say that ten times. Fetch quests for Krieg. And now we're going to get his gauntlet. Reclaiming the jewel. Sorry, this next memory, it's personal. I haven't seen her since. So we're basically going through Krieg's brain, it's all we have Krieg's to memories. Have. I'll meet you there. I've got to have a chat with this guy. The pretty interesting thing is, is what Krieg's thoughts are about the other Vault Hunters. Krieg seems like he's an outcast. He feels that the other Vault Hunters. You don't like him or something and he you know he looks at them as not like companions but more so like i'm not gonna kill them i'm not gonna mess with them they're just there so it's just kind of interesting to see what yeah, krieg's perspective on the other right. vault hunters are which uh and this guy <laughs> pretty interesting see eye to eye on anything except her pretty lady but i the experiments I really messed him up and I now he's a psycho Everything else might be Where's she at? Crazy around here, but at least he didn't change her. She looks just like when I saw her last. Who are you looking hey, at? Guy? Oh, Maya. Oh, wow. Maya. What? Come say hello. What the? <laughs> okay. Maya. I know she's gone, but she seems so real, just like I remember her. Perfect. Creek? Am I losing it? Like, is what? I didn't know Krieg had a thing for Maya, bro. Maybe I'm like completely out of the whole lore of it, but let's check it out, man. Uh oh. No! Oh, and Maya had a thing for Krieg too. In Krieg's brain again, we gotta keep in mind. What the? Is this a mini boss? The train? We got a train mini boss? Uh oh. Uh oh. Bro, that's interesting, man. I I must completely have been out of the loop with that one, man. Also, this is kind of cool. We met her, and he thought it was taking her away. This is my fault for letting him run amok in our memories. But let me know in the comments if if I missed something. Let me go, Craig. Again, Calamity. it could just be this. Know, this is Krieg's brain, so Krieg could be delusional. But then again, normal Krieg shot seems shot to pretty much be on point. Would you look at that? I am detecting a huge spike in neural activity across the board. No matter how far apart we are, Krieg. I mean, I granted, I, I have not played like the um, the Tales of the Borderlands or really anything like that. So, I mean, is there something in there? That I just missed? Like, did I just miss something? <laughs> I don't know. That's weird. I feel like I'm pretty up to date on all the Borderlands stuff for the most part, man. So this one is definitely uh, yeah, a weird one that I just did not expect. Y'all are probably like, dude, Eagle Dummy. Yeah, bro. In episode 7.3 of Tales of the Borderlands, you should have found out and assumed that Krieg and Maya were a thing. I do love the gameplay. I know I said that last episode, man, but the gameplay of Borderlands 3 is sick. 
The original storyline is meh, but honestly, this DLC I, I, is kind of sick, bro. I like I like this DLC so far, man. It doesn't, you know, it's not like I don't know. I felt like the 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 just the normal story was kind of just weird, man. I don't know, like the 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 twins and shit, like the whole like social media thing, like eh, let's let's record a video and like stream us killing these vault hunters, yeah, which you know I get the premise of it. I don't know. It's just kind of it, it was it was Borderlands esque. You know what I mean? I I feel like it's pretty sick. You know, it'd be awesome. Also, just kind of a random thought that popped into my head. But what if they had like special legendaries dedicated to the vault hunters themselves? Like, let's say you have like a melee weapon that says Krieg's bu Buzz Axe, or maybe you have like Lilith's I don't know SMG or something, or Salvador's pistol. Whatever you want to whatever you want to do, Mordecai's or Zero's sniper. You know what I'm saying? Like. That I think that would be super freaking cool, man. I think it'd be something that they should they should add into Borderlands 4, to be honest, bro. Because everyone will want to go for like Zero or Mordecai's sniper rifle, for example, right? Ooh. I know there's some like side missions. If you guys really want to see the side quests, bro, I can always come back and do them. I'm going to keep on the just the main story just because, again, I don't want this Let's Play to be too long. Again, again unless you guys want me to, then I could go back and play the uh, the side quests. But for now, we're just going to stick to the main storyline. Oh, what's this? Okay, this kind of came out of nowhere. We're going to go this way. We're going to hunt the Locomobius. Locomobius. Boom, boom, boom. Bro, we're feeling good on this on this keyboard mouse, man. Like I know I've been like when I do my Borderlands 2 vids, I know I'm on keyboard mouse also, but like it's it's not as intense as this shit. You know, like I'm literally running around and like, you know, you're sliding and stuff, so it's not intense. So like f playing in like an intense environment or not like, you know, intense style is a little bit different, but I'm feeling pretty freaking good on it, man. Badass crushers. We haven't died yet, so that's kind of cool. Knock on wood, right? Also, uh, what? Uh, uh, well, I apologize for the slight disruption. Apparently, we were too much for the game to handle. So, here we are. All right, dude, so we're back. <laughs> At least we know what to do now, right? Bro, if we actually have to fight this train, that'd actually be kind of interesting. B very Borderlands-esque, right? Just have, like, random boss fights. But as I was thinking, you know, when, I, when I'm talking about, like, going through Borderlands 2 with Krieg, I'm thinking about putting a little spice on it. We're not just gonna do a Let's Play. But if you guys have seen my content, seen my channel, I'm big into farming, like, of course, legendaries, uh, unique weapons, all that fun stuff, man. And, uh, I think what I'm gonna do... Is yes, we're gonna play through the story, just the main story with Krieg. However, before moving on to like a different section of the map or the story, we have to get that boss's basically their legendary loot. So, for example, when we get to the dust, we have to complete the legendary farming for every potential legendary in the dust before we can move on in the story. Yeah, we're gonna do that. That's gonna be a little bit of a, hey, a little bit of a teaser. But, uh, we're gonna put some spice on it, man. Because, yes, we can bust through it with Krieg. Yes, we can just go in and freaking shred through the story like it's nothing. So, we're gonna put a little oomph into it, man. But that'll probably be my next series. Once, uh, once we go through this playthrough. Jesus, these badasses are pretty, pretty tough, man. Super badass maniacs. And I'm not, like very knowledgeable on the characters in borderlands 3 itself like i am obviously we're running amara but i'm sure there are like crazy amara melee builds you could put together and all that stuff man i'm sure there's a lot of things you could do that also why the hell did i jump up here dude i'm stupid what bro i literally just came back here oh my god all right well i came back here to literally like trigger that now we're going now we're going back this way. I don't even know, like, if this if this DLC presented, like, different legendaries, different anointments on guns. Like, I'm not... 
even sure if I should be farming particular like bosses or mini bosses in this DLC or whatnot, but we're gonna get through it. All right, so Locomobius is obviously going, dude. What I feel? Oh shit! What? Okay, <laughs> the caboose came out of nowhere. Clear area of enemies. I feel like I've already done that. Dude, I am curious as to why, like, the... Like, what's up with the train? Like, you know, my didn't die to the train... To a train, you know what I mean? Do I gotta, like, save and quit to reset these enemies or something? Whoa! Why am I still on fire? What? Dog. There we go. Okay, so we got the enemies respawning. Boom, boom, boom. Take him out, bro. Oh, shit. Oh. Oh, my. Oh, God. All right, all right, all right, all right. Nomad brutalizes. We all love our nomads in Borderlands, huh? Oh, holy shit. What? Bro, I feel like sometimes I'm just getting, like, pelted by something. And I have no idea what it is, whether it's, like, a... Yeah, give me that second win. It feels like one of the midget tanks are on my neck, like smacking me in the head, bro. That's what it feels like. Like doof, 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 doof. Yeah. Okay, there we go. That was the play. We did have to literally reset it. Okay, that's fine. I say we strap a bunch of bombs to this bad boy and run the Send it. Send it. Full send. Maybe everyone needs a little madman in them to survive. Parkour, parkour. <laughs> Rocket ship destruction. Yeah, what he said. Slap those explosives on the back of the caboose. Then we're gonna play a little bit of miniature golf. But like, gigantic miniature golf. We die in here all the time, actually. It's kind of nightmarish. Look at this dude chilling. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Then. This dude's raging up there, man. <laughs> oh. Shoot the fuel tank. Why am I stupid? Oh, it's up top. Boom, sucker. Oh, we got slow mo. <laughs> Let's go. That's all we needed. Just like that, huh? Easy. That must be its lair. We got the train's lair chilling up here, man. All right, let's go up. Let's get it. Train beast seems to be doing everything in its power to prevent Train beast, bro. I wish like it wasn't a normal looking train though. Like it's a normal looking train. I wish it had like a face on it or like, oh god. Or like it was like a creepy looking train, you know what I mean? That'd be sick. It was like something like creepy as hell looking. It's like, ooh. Cre like the, the train's got like a demon face on it or like, I don't know. Even like Tyreen's face or something. You know what I'm saying? Something like that. Because like, train the invincible just being a normal train. Uh, you know, it's it doesn't it doesn't do it for me, dude. I don't know. I don't know. Also, if y'all want me to do a series on legendary weapons and items in Borderlands 3, let me know, bro. I already do have some out there, like, way back when I freaking first got back into it. Whoa. It's like, okay, so it's like we're dodging these. Dodging these freaking train attacks, as you will. But yeah, man, if you want me to make some videos on, like, where to find, like, legendaries and stuff, like, I can, I'm cool with getting brushed back up to speed on Borderlands 3. Y'all been just checking out my most recent stuff. It's been all Borderlands 2. But I don't know, man. Borderlands 3 just feels... It feels good. Obviously, the story's eh. The gameplay's really nice. And obviously, you know, I'm a, I'm a big fan of the Borderlands series regardless. So... Whoa. So I am down to, uh, to make some vids on some of these Borderlands 3 legendary weapons as well, dude. But only the ones that have dedicated drops. Only those ones.
We don't want to do the ones that you can get randomly from any loot, suitable loot source because those are kind of boring to hit. All right, so we're literally like doing this whole what's that? What's that one game where you got to go on the train car or it's like the the mobile game and you got to like collect the coins and stuff? You know what I'm saying? And hey, it's just following an angry anthropomorphic brain train into a strange portal, right? What's the worst that could happen? Socks instead of bread. Can you imagine? Shh, jump in that mo. All right, here we go. Now tell her thank you. Tell her that because of her, we might actually one day be able to act like a normal person again. All right, so after some in-depth research, as in one Reddit post, <coughs> uh, I, it just seems like Maya was the only one that Krieg liked. And not like that, like that, apparently it wasn't like a, like a weird relationship thing. They were just nice. She was just nice to him. And he just apparently, like, I don't know. Seems like Maya was the only one he actually gave a shit about. The other ones, he's like, yeah, mean siren, red hair lady. I'm not gonna let that thing take her. The memories are all I have left. And apparently, I mean, obviously he's got he's got feelings for Maya, but apparently it didn't go f any further than that. But if you listen to like how he talks about the other vault hunters, that of course, like within just the Borderlands universe, he was not a big fan of any of them, just Maya. <laughs> Okay, we're doing that, huh? Jesus, dude, one smack? <laughs> all right, all right, all right, it's okay. We we know now, we know. It's a little wake-up call. A little bit of a wake-up call on that one, but we're good. We're, we're back at it. <laughs> oh, shit. All right. High damage, but there are defense, there are... TTK, whatever you want to call it, sucks. Easy. Easy kills there, boys. But, ooh, almost fell there. Reach Locomobius' Leia. Bro, I swear, if the endgame boss in this DLC is a freaking train, man. A mental block. I think the train is trying to trap us in here. The clickers take rain over sweet meat prizes. They're drawn to memories of Maya, so use the book to lure them out here. All right, so we gotta put Maya's book on the ground. I'll be back before you Navigate know. Navigate Wind. All right, so we got the wraiths now. Okay, okay, okay. Bang, sucker! Literally one tap, one taps, one taps for everybody. One tap all around for all y'all. Well, besides the badasses or the possessed shit. I think I think those are gonna be a little bit more, but you know, pretty much. Oh, Harold. Okay. Harold's a little bit. Well, never mind. Harold is easy. Are there more, multiple Heralds? Or was it just one Herald? Oh, there's multiple Heralds. Oh, badass Wraith. I will say the only downfall of the Borderlands 3 movement, which I know they had to do it, is, the, is how sluggish I feel, man. I don't feel like I'm moving that fast. Like the like the sprint speed is sl is low. But I know they have to do that to make like the physics with sliding and jumping and mantling and all that shit work, but Whoa, okay. Uh oh. It got dark real quick, huh? But like, you know, I, I know there are some I think it was Flack, man. When I'm running around with Flack though, like he gets a he gets a speed boost, man, dude. That the speed boost is freaking phenomenal. I should have probably ran this with Flack. That's all right. Amara is good too. Don't get me wrong. I like Amara, but like, bro, the when you get like, I don't know if it's like a speed buff boost with kills or something, man. But I just remember playing and you're just flying around the map. Like, I want that feeling. You know what I'm saying? Oh god, that train literally almost like got me to fall off. <laughs> oh god, <laughs> get the f going. Oh my god. Oh god. Well, this train is really trying to get some, huh? Another side mission, but again. Let me know, y'all. I don't know if I could even go back and do the. I mean, I, you probably can go back and you gotta be able to. So let me know. Let me know if, if you want me to go back and do these side missions, y'all. 
Um, oh god. Frosty badass Varkids. Sit them. Sit them. I also kind of want to go through the Borderlands 3 bosses. Like, I don't know. I feel good on this game. I feel like I can absolutely shred these bosses, dude. So maybe we just do like some, um, I don't know, maybe like a little mini series of us running through like the freaking Borderlands 3, like Invincibles or something. You know, the bosses, there's a lot, most of them actually that I haven't even fought or killed or anything. So uh, maybe we do something like that, man. Cause I feel like I can, I feel like we can get them. Cut. My thoughts exactly. I mean, oh, Maya's trapped in this freaking like ball of spikes and wood. Oh, well, that was easy. Okay. What up, Maya? Bro, Maya was. Besides Sal, I gotta go Maya Borderlands too, man. Then again, Krieg's probably up there too. I haven't really played with Krieg, but Maya's OP as hell, dude. That thing's gonna be back any second. You ready for this? Slaking the bloodthirst for crushing and pounding. Oh my god, okay. Say that. Let's do it. Sister, it would be an honor. Oh, here we go. Okay, so that didn't do any damage at all. Destroy Locomobius. Alright, where you at? Oh, okay, 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 okay. Hold on. Do I have like a Oh, something that that's not it. That's not the one. Hold on, let's uh let's take a look. Let's see, let's see if we have anything. We're gonna use the prompt critical, bruh. Where you at? Where you at? Yeah, get over here, mofo. Where'd you go? I missed you so. Bro, I've literally only taken like a freaking nut hair of this health. Come on, man. Yo, Maya, can't you, like, phase lock this thing or something, bro? Like, phase lock it. Real quick. Is that Maya shooting phase locks, or am I tripping? Dude, grab this thing, Maya. Grab it! Where's its crits? Oh, that wasn't it. No one take a picture. Yo, this gun ain't doing jack to it, bro. Whoa, is that the that hit crit? All right, all right. We got we got <laughs> we got to find something else, y'all. <laughs> oh, okay. All right, bro. We're gonna try this thing, man. What is this? Oh, Jesus. Immune. F shit. All right, bro. We're going to try out the bear cat, man. We're going to see if the bear cat does it. It is cryo, though. Remember the bear cat from Borderlands 2? The pearl? Bear cat ain't doing jack shit. Oh my god, this bear cat sucks. Oh my goodness. Boom. Whoa, okay, dude. This this unkempt herald's actually smacking it. Hey, there you go. There we go, Maya. This is see, this is what I've this is what I've been asking you to do, dude. This unkempt herald throwback bro op right now op on this thing look at it it's been taking this thing out quick it's just trial and error y'all trial and error and we i think have found our uh our saving grace if i can hit my shots dude look at this thing holy shit <laughs> let's go this is gonna be an easy kill get back here where's it at boom 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 Dude, this thing is sick. I mean, we're throwing it back to the unkempt herald. 
And that's the one that's freaking taking it out, bro. You love to see it. You love to see it. Bam. There it is, man. Unkempt Herald remains OP. Even in Borderlands 3. Let's go. Good job. Good job, Maya. Thanks for phase locking it twice in that whole fight. Appreciate that. Shit. Where are you going? Maya, wait. No. Wait, bro. The gauntlet. Whenever we had to defend ourselves, we got, the I always imagined we got it. Was by our side, protecting us. The old legendary Kree gauntlet. Don't you want to come with me? Train's leaving the station, big guy. Last chance. I remember this. Uh oh. Why don't you want to come with me? Buckets of chums squelch naked on the ground. <laughs> I told her we had nothing to offer. We'd it's been like the Thanos for so gauntlet, long. right? Fighting to survive. And that's when it happened. She heard me. <sighs> There's more to life than just survival, you big dummy. Don't you have something worth fighting for? And in that moment, I realized we did. Yes, indeed. Is this the end of the game? Is this it? If not, this will be the end of the episode. And we will maybe get to the finale next episode? I don't know, man. I have no idea how long the Creed DLC actually is. She's the only person that ever gave me This could be it. She still is. I wish I could take her with me when I leave, but anyway... Let's head back. All right, so obviously Krieg's... I mean, we, we know Krieg's had a big thing for Maya. We figured that out. Okay, so we do have those loot boxes. This might have been it, man. Two episode DLC. Okay. We got a legendary, the binary destructo spinner. Weapon damage increased by 100%. Okay. Let's grab this echo device. Let's see what, uh, what they have to say. Here we go. I promised when I left Pandora that we'd see each other again. I met this girl. She's a real handful, just like I was. Ava? She's headstrong. The reason I'm saying all this is... I'm not sure... I'm not sure if every siren knows when they meet the person they're going to pass their gifts to. Ava's my best shot at leaving this world a better one. Right now, I'm at the end of a thread of sirens spanning thousands of years know that death and time can't take you and I away from each other. I'm too stubborn for that. So if I go, just know that I'll see you in the stars, big guy. I promise. Okay. Alright, let's talk to Sane Krieg. If this is the end, we'll find out, but I don't know if it is. We're gonna figure this out. Alright, we got the what do we got? Yeah, we got the gauntlet. What's next? Then I'm gone for good. Okay, so we don't have the statue completed. For the striker. Okay, let's throw the, let's throw the gauntlet on. Boom. Oh, we probably just need the mask. Ah! I called it. Okay. All right. Perfect timing. What? What could you possibly be afraid of? The whiteness of his coat. Oh. Mm. Yeah. He's talking about the doc, doctor. What? What's his what name? Benedict. Get the mask. He says we have to go back to yep. where it all began. I see. I'm like where a mind reader, y'all. I know what I'm effing talking about. The needle man cometh. Okay, so we got to go to Doctor Benedict. The pain wagon. We got to get this mask. This one might be a little rough for us, but go ahead, Vault Hunter. Whenever you. All right, ready. Craig. I'll. I will be ready next episode, bro. Trust me. Uh, and y'all. Appreciate you for stopping by, man, in the second episode of the Creek DLC Borderlands 3, bro. And if you guys do enjoy, of course, hit that thumbs up, sub to the channel. Next episode, looks like we're getting this freaking mask. And we'll probably end up fighting, uh, was it Dr. Benedict that turned Krieg into a psycho? So, we'll see, man. It's going to be pretty interesting. But anyway, guys, appreciate you for stopping by. As always, I'll catch you in the next one. Peace. Unkempt Herald's amazing still.